And now, on mat number 12, the adult male black belt rooster wing final, representing Alianze, Zayed al -Kafiri. and representing Art of Jiu-Jitsu, Hiro Niwa. Zayed of Alliance in the blue gi, Hiro Niwa in the white gi, representing Art of Jiu-Jitsu. And we are underway with this 2023 Pan Jiu Jitsu Championships Rooster Weight Final in the Black Belt Division. Here, Yuniwa gets to the close guard. Syed gets the advantage coming up from the double guard pole. Trying to open up this close guard. Niwa setting up that De La Hiva. Zayed trying to cut that right shin over the De La Hiva hook. And here you're trying to maintain some distance with that right leg. Comes up on top, scores the two points, but he's right up into that single leg X guard with the underhook on the leg of Zayed. One minute into this one, here Yuniwa up two points to Zayed's one advantage. On top, Guy Mendez is in his corner. Like I mentioned, both these guys relatively new black belts. Zayed answers with a sweep of his own from those double pan grips, scores two. Trying to get around the legs of here Yuniwa. Good little pass attempt there. But Niwa able to reset his guard. Zayed coming up pretty aggressive off that sweep. Doing the right thing of holding those pants at the knees and just trying to pass right away. Niwa doing a great job recovering guard. And yeah, that was something we talked about in the Eric Muniz match. When he sweeps, he comes up and tries to attack the guard pass right away in that transition. Especially holding those, those knees right off the sweep and just Toriano right away, crisscrossing the arms and just uh, looking for the pass. Two minutes into this one, Zayed is leading by one advantage. Both athletes have two points. Rooster weight final here at the 2023 Pan Jiu Jitsu Championships. Zayed got Michael, it's got Michael Lange in his corner. Who's been doing a lot of coaching this weekend. A lot of really great Alliance athletes. Yeah. Putting on great displays throughout all the belt, belt the levels. The general. Fabio Grigel is not in attendance, so uh, Michael Lange kind of took over as head coach of Alliance Jiu-Jitsu for this Pan Ams. The Niwa brothers, if you check them out on Instagram, they have some amazing technical uh, clips. They're showing their techniques are just incredible. So it was uh, no coincidence that they were able to head over to AOJ and just evolve their technique to another level. Syed now doing a great job. Syed trying to look for that straight ankle lock. This guy's left foot on the hip, trying to create some distance. Hard to tell how tight his grip is on the ankle. But Niwa has that left grip on the lapel, trying to prevent Zayed from bridging and creating that space that he would need to finish the footlock. Zayed using that footlock to try to make space and elevate. And now he's coming on top. He's going to get an advantage for that. Oh, no, he's going to get two. I think he got the advantage for the straight ankle lock, yeah. two points for the sweep. He's up two advantages now, 4-4 four, four on points. Four minutes into this 2023 Roosterweight final here at the Pans. Here, Yuniwa on bottom in the Waikiki, representing Art Jiu Jitsu, being coached by Guilherme Mendez. Zayed on top in the blue gi, representing Alliance with Michael Lange in his corner. Following this match, we're going to have the Diego Hayes, Diego, pa Diego Pato, light featherweight final. 
After that, Fabricio Andre against Marshall Andre, followed by Pablo Lavaselli and Jonathan Alves. Pedro Henrique da Costa against Tynan Dalpra. Gustavo Batista against Jansen Gomez. Adam Wardzinski against Felipe Andrew. Gabrielli Pisania against Ana Carolina and Nicholas Marigali versus Eric Muniz. Plenty more action coming your way live from the 2023 Pan American Championships. You are now working on that lapel grip. Has the grip fed to his left hand. Seen some good attacks from, from this gripping sequence. Maisa Bastos was actually using it in her final in the light feather division where she won another pan title. Used it to sweep and actually to attack the back of her opponent, Niwa seeming, seemingly trying to use a similar strategy. Zayed's got a bend in that foot. We'll see if he tries to attack the toe hold. Pushing it down towards his hip. Let's go of it. Niwa gets to the top. Zayed getting that grip once again. You are clearing the leg there. Zaya just not letting go of that ankle. Using the, using the legs to stretch out Niwa from the top, trying to get up. Nice sweep by Zayed. Coming up on top. These two are just trading sweeps back and forth. The, the combination of uh, ankle lock to sweep and extension that Zayed is doing is very reminiscent of what Bianca Basilio would do in her competitions where she creates this dilemma for the opponent, whether to concede on the sweep or have their ankle broken. And uh, Zayed's doing a great job of maintaining this control, getting to the top position, and dominating with that grip. Yeah, it's important to note that Zayed's also up those three advantages. So if they keep just exchanging sweeps, He's going to maintain that lead. Zayed doing a good job controlling that right leg of here, Uniwa, pushing it down towards the mat, not letting up, letting him set up. De La Hiva. Now Niwa trying to get underneath the hips of Zayed. Try and answer back with another sweep. Good little long step by Zayed. And they'll go out of bounds and get reset back in the middle. Here you Niwa on bottom in the white gi, representing Auto Jiu Jitsu, Zayed on top in the blue gi, representing Alliance. Niwa with that lapel grip. Trying to invert. Zayed trying to maintain some pressure here. Shut down the sweep attempt of Hiryu Niwa. This is a very close technical match between these two rooster weights. This may be one of the only pan finals in the history where we have two non-Brazilians and not even Americans competing. We have a UAE representative versus, I believe, a Korean descent. Yes, I believe so. Korean or maybe Japanese? My, my bad. From Japan, I should say. My, thank you for the clarification there. From Yokohama, Japan, the Niwa brothers. So Japan versus UAE here at the 2023 Pan Jiu-Jitsu Championships. 
Just proof that jiu-jitsu is growing all around the world. People are reaching a high level all across the planet. This match is tied at six points apiece. Coming up on one minute left, Zayed up three advantages over here, Uniwa. They've traded sweeps. Three sweeps each. Niwa now trying to come up. On He's a got a double here. leg. Let's see if he tries to connect his hands. He's trying to finish. Zayed doing a great job avoiding this takedown. He was up on the double. Zayed may look to throw him over the top if he's not careful. Doing a great job of defending. Look at the balance of Zayed there. Niwa is trying to finish this double with everything he's got. He's got to turn the corner here or switch to a single and turn it out. But Niwa, oh, and Zayed, Zayed stays on top. Zayed sprawling out. Niwa not giving up on this. And they're going to go out of bounds. Thirteen seconds left. Zayed up by three advantages. This has been a great match. Yeah, very back and forth, tight match. They each have scored three sweeps. Zayed up on those three advantages. They're gonna reset. Short amount of time left in this one. Niwa needs to make something happen. He's gonna try and go for the takedown. Niwa trying to push Zayed. Niwa pulls guard right away. He's got three seconds to do something here. Zayed. And that has it. He's your 2023 Roosterweight Pan Champion. Beautiful performance by Zayed Abdul Nasir of Alliance Jiu Jitsu. From the UAE. This may, in fact, be the first time. Uh, UA and Emirati has uh, won the Pan Am Championships with the black belt. Zayed Abdul Nasir, beautiful performance in that final against Hiryu Niwa. He is your 2023 Pan Roosterweight Champion. Let's take a look at the replay. What a great match. Back and forth yeah, battle. Very technical, both of these guys. Just demonstrates uh, the growth of Jiu Jitsu and, you know, to see two competitors such as this, two, you know, rookie black belts coming into the finals. Great matchup. Here we see some of their sweeps. Zayed coming up on this one. Niwa trying to finish this takedown. Zayed doing a beautiful job defending it. Match gets reset in the center. Zayed is your Roosterweight champion here at the 2023 Pans. In third place, representing Alianze. Not a bit. In second place, representing the art of Jiu Jitsu, Hiru Niwa. And your 2023 adult male black belt rooster weight champion, Zayed Al Kathiri, representing Alianze. Zayed Al Dinasser from Alianze in the UAE is your 2023 Pan American Jiu Jitsu champion. Don't go anywhere, guys. We're going to have the light featherweight finals between Diogo Hayes and Diego Pato coming your way in just a moment. <laughs> 